What is up guys, it's Robert and today I am out at Huckstone Woods. You can see all the trees, so it's pretty obvious. But I am at this jump. I'm just going to practice my jump. Probably try and get like T bars in, which I believe is where you do this. So you grab the handlebars two hand like do that like I don't know do that or something like just twist the handlebars to the side you probably won't be able to see mine because I do midget ones because I'm a I'm a scaredy cat I don't like I don't really like pushing myself but for mountain biking you actually need to push yourself so yeah I'm gonna film me doing a couple jumps on this. Like, I'm gonna try and get higher jumps. Cause usually I just come down and I usually just go off the ramp with enough speed to make the whole jump. But I'm going to, I'm probably going to do a couple cases today because I'm going to actually try as hard as I can and I'm going to do it, like, do the jump properly where you like push your front forks push your forks into the ramp as hard as you can well not as hard as you can just like pre preload i think it is like you just push your fr uh, front forks into the into the ramp then you like just like get extra air and land here but right, i've already done a i've already done a couple jumps today and stuff so yeah, I'm just gonna get a couple clips of me doing that, and I might try a new jump. Just came out of my mind. I might try a new jump. Um, it's down there. There's like a couple berms. I'm just zooming. Uh, where's my finger? That's there. Oh, I got a really shaky left hand. That thing there. One sec. That uh, I'll show you later, but I'm just gonna get a couple of clips of me doing this. Rough, kind of. Oh. I don't know if I got that much hair. I'm just gonna check on this. You couldn't really tell how much hair I got there. So, um, I'm gonna put my phone in a different, I'm gonna put my phone in a different position. But, I haven't told you, but I've got some new, I've got new grips and new pedals. Like, the pedals are only plus, oh god, I'm stuck. Ugh. The pedals are only plastic, but that's all proper, like, you can swap out the pins in these. And i got proper lock-on grips here, so I don't have to worry about struggling to get my other grips off. So yeah, I'm going to put my phone in a different position, and hopefully you can see if I get much air or if I don't get much air. It's a pretty small jump, so... I don't really expect to get too much there, so yeah. Ah. Felt like I got tons of hang time for that jump there. That was pretty good. I would say, for this little jump. I feel like I went too high, so I'm just going to check. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the jump, which I pointed at in full zoom. Didn't really go very well, so I'm just going to show you what up close right now. Okay, so for this jump, you want to come around this berm. So... Like, I usually just, like, cut the berm and just go straight to that berm. But, like, you usually need to come around this berm. 
we need to come around this bum and come here, go around this bum here, and then pretty high, and then come up here, and there's this jump here. It's about the same size as the jump which I've just showed you, like I've seen on my previous channel, but you have that much uh, space to get speed. And then you come over here, then you have a jump over that. There's like a another jump down here, which I just I just roll over it, pretty much nothing else. I just roll over that one. So yeah, I'm gonna try and see if I can do this. I'm going to do it without recording just to see what happens, but. See you then. I'm probably only going to film it once because I just did it and I came up here. I did the jump. I, I didn't make it. I don't. I think my back wheel was like manual and across it. I can't even manual though. But I came across and I came down here. You can see my little skid on my front wheel hit this. So I'm only going to. I'm not, so I'm only going to record it. Me doing it once. Cause it's really sketchy it's got like massive rocks sticking out of it yeah, it's got massive rocks sticking out of it so it's a bit, the jump's a bit sketch um so yeah Oh, didn't go, didn't go that far, I have to admit. Went hardly anywhere. Yeah. I mean, it is pretty big, it's about the size of my bike. So, yeah. <sighs> I need to build more tabletops in this place. Because I only like tabletops. Because I don't like thinking... I'm fine with like step down tabletop type things, but I don't. I just don't like the feeling. There's a massive gap, and if you don't make it, it's gonna hurt. So I might some some day in the future, I might come out here and. fix up these jumps, make them into tabletops, so therefore I don't be a wuss, and I actually hit them in the future. Like, there's a jump which I actually really want to hit, which is up, so not here, but you come down from here, you come down from here with enough speed, you come around this corner, you come around this tree, and you, like... Do that little p pumpy thing off this and over this, which is pretty big as well. Like, you know Charlie, the dude who was in my previous video? I showed him doing this and he cased it bad. Like, you, I'm pretty sure you can still see where he cased it. One sec. Cased it there really bad and some other place. Like, I think here, like, there was a part, like, he did, he attempted it, he attempted three times, and he, like, um, he, like, on one of the first attempts, his, like, back wheel landed where my foot is, around there, so that was really big case, it sounded like his, um, it sounded like his wheel broke his rim, so, yeah. Okay, so I've decided to cut the video short, and I'm ending the video now. So, um, guess I'll see you in the next video. Peace.